Good afternoon everyone. Today I'm going to perform my second COT demonstration recorded. This is Science 5 with the topic on changes in the appearance of the moon. Okay, let's get started. Good afternoon grade 5. How are you today? Yes, that's nice to hear. I am fine too. Okay, today before we will start with our lesson, I would like you to please stand up. Let us sing a song together with the video. The song is all about seeing the moon. Okay, everybody should see. I see the moon and the moon sees me. God bless the moon and God bless me. One more time. Go. I see the moon and the moon sees me. God bless the moon and God bless me. Okay. Right. Everybody please sit down. What? Is the song all about? Bread. Yes, it's about the moon. Now, I want you to see this one. Okay, try to take a look at the moon and observe what happens. Linda, what can you say? About the moon on the slide. Yes, very good. It's turning. What else? Rolando. Yes, the moon is changing. It looks. Very good. Now try to look at the moon. You can see that the moon is getting out. And then it shines again. Getting smaller and smaller, and then no more. Okay, why do you think it happens? Okay, this is the changes on the appearance of the moon. Do you know what are the changes in the appearance of the moon? Okay, so this afternoon, we are going to learn on the changes on the appearance of the Moon. Okay, everybody, let us read the title, Changes in the Appearance of the Moon. Okay, now for you to know what are the changes in the appearance of the moon, I want you to take a look at this video. Okay. And the phases are named after how much of the moon we can see and whether the amount visible is increasing or decreasing each day. What are the names of these phases? They are new moon, waxing crescent, first quarter, waxing gibbous, full, waning gibbous, last quarter, Oh, I'm confused. Can you repeat it? Why not? Let us have a look again and understand it. No problem. Now look carefully. Phase 1 is called the new moon. In this phase, we cannot see any part of the illuminated half of the moon. Phase 2 is called the waxing crescent. Waxing means that the moon is going from a smaller size to a larger size. And crescent means that it is between new moon and half moon. It looks like a sickle, like when you take a bite out of a cookie. Phase 3 is called the first quarter. In this phase, the moon appears half lit to us. 
Phase 4 is the waxing gibbous moon. In this phase, the moon appears more than half lit. The moon shows a hump. Phase 5 is the full moon, beautiful and poetic. Phase 6 is the waning gibbous moon. The moon is waning, that is decreasing, going from full moon to quarter moon. Phase 7 is the last quarter. The moon appears half lit again. Phase 8 is the waning crescent moon. This is the last phase before the next new moon. Now the faces of the moon are very clear to me. How many days does the moon? Okay. Now you have seen the video. Hey, the changes in the appearance of the moon are also called faces of the moon. Okay. Now, if you try to take a look. Okay. Right? This one. Okay. The illustration will show that there are changes in the appearance of the moon. Okay. Now, I will try to test if you have understood the video. Okay. We will have an activity. Okay. This activity is called Pick Me Here. What's me there? You pick something or one card here and then you try to match the card to each to, to its description. Okay. Now, right? Who will do first? Okay. Okay, Jenny. Come in front, take one from here and then try to match the description over there. Okay, Linda. Okay, Linda, what's that? Crescent moon. Okay, what is crescent moon, Linda? Okay, so Linda had said it's a small part of the edge of the light. Yes, correct. Okay, yes. Roy, next. Okay. Roy, what's that? New moon. What is new moon, Roy? New moon is very good, Roy. It's totally black. Okay, one more time. Rosemary. Okay, first quarter moon. What is first quarter moon, Rosemary? Okay, the half, the half light at the right side. Of course, the first week of the month. Okay, very good. So this is our first activity. Did you understand? Okay, now let's try to explain. Okay, so the first phase of the moon is called the, yes, Brando, new moon. Very good. How will you describe the new moon? Yes, Joanne. Yes, it's totally black. Very good. The second uh, face of the moon. What is it? Yes, Caroline. Waxing crescent. How will you describe waxing crescent? Yes, part of the moon is seen. Why do we say it's waxing? Yes, Anna. Yes, very good. Waxing because from smaller, it is getting bigger. From nothing, you will say that the moon is getting Bigger and bigger. Okay, the third phase. What is it? Yes, Anna. First quarter is correct. How will you describe first quarter? It is a half moon at the right. Okay. Now, you can see that the lighted part of the moon is at the right side. Next, what is the next phase of the moon? Okay. Yes, Rupert. All right. Waxing gibbous. Very good. Why is it gibbous? It is very good. It's a bulge more than half. Okay. Next, the most beautiful part uh, when you want to watch the moon is the, yes, Linda, full moon. Very good. Now, are you happy to look at the full moon? 
Yes, very good. We have we are happy looking at the moon when it is full and very bright. Okay, the next phase. Yes. Okay, it's morning gibbos. Now it is the opposite of the waxing gibbos. Why? Very good because it is getting smaller. When we say waxing, it's getting bigger. But the one in gibbos now becoming smaller in shape. Okay, next shape of the moon. Yes, very good. Last quarter moon. Okay, last quarter half moon. And when you will see the last quarter, you will see the half bright side of the moon okay it is the opposite of the first quarter okay and the seventh phase is the yes very good it's the wanting present wanting again it's getting smaller and smaller after the wedding crescent the moon will be Okay, very good. Back to its new moon again. So this is the complete cycle of the moon. Okay, the movement of the moon. Okay, so this cycle, this movement of the moon from waxing movement to the warning movement causes the changes of the appearance of the moon okay what is the other term for the changes in the appearance of the moon very good very good phases of the moon okay very good now let's try this activity okay i want you okay to come in front click the mouse try to match the picture if its name is much uh, matching. Okay. Okay. Here, click the face appearance of the moon corresponding to its given name. Okay. Full moon, which picture? Yes, Joy. Okay, come in front. Okay, Joy, click. Oh, Joy, nice try. Okay, one more time. Okay, who can click and try to find the correct picture of the full moon? Juan. Okay. Very good. Okay, this time, I will group you in two, three. Okay, you will have here station one, two, and three. Each group will read the direction and then you follow what is in the direction. Okay, group one, two, or four. Okay, group two, fill in the missing word. Group three, match column A with column B. Okay, I'll give you five minutes only. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, back to your seat and let's try to check your work. Okay, group one. Okay, perfect. Very good. Group two. Let us check. Yes, it's great. Perfect again. Okay, group three. Wow. Okay, congratulations, children. You understand our lesson. Okay, this time, I want you to discover. Okay, now pick one star. Then, identify the picture that you can see here. Okay, this is who am I? Okay, Brian. Okay, what is that, Brian? It's new moon. Very good, Brian. It's new moon. Okay, next, fair. What's that, fair? If you try to look at it, what is this? This is a gibbous moon. Okay, the moon is more than half. Okay, very good. Now, did you understand our lesson? Very good. Okay, now if you try to look at the moon, what will you feel? Happy? Yes. How can 
then you share your happiness to your family. If you feel happy, how can you share your happiness? Telling mama and papa that you are happy. Now what will you do so that mama and papa also will be happy? Yes, very good. Be obedient. What else? Yes, fun. Yes, very good. Being respectful. Now if you do this, your parents, not only parents, but everybody is happy if you have that kind of character. Okay, this time we will have a test. Okay. Now, read the statements and encircle the letter of the correct answer. Okay. One, two, three, four times up. Okay, let us check. Okay, very good. Now, you understood our lesson. Now, you have to remember that the moon, okay, one thing to remember is a satellite of the earth that has no light of its own. Okay, there are six different changes in the appearance of the moon. And what are these changes? We have what we call as full moon, new moon, crescent moon, gibbous moon, quarter moon, and last quarter. Okay, now, did you understand? Okay, very good. I am happy. Now, for your assignment, draw and arrange and for order the faces of the moon. Okay, yes. Tomorrow, we will check your assignment. See you tomorrow, the same time. Goodbye, children. And thank you for listening. Okay, thank you.